Hello viewers, we'll be going over the S&P 500, ticker symbol SPY, and this video will be going over my trade idea of the week, and we'll be going over the day-by-day -day probability model. So let's start off with the technical analysis. We're currently down 1.7% on the one-hour chart. We have reached to negative MACD, and we have also reached to oversold RSI. If we expand that further onto the four-hour chart, what we have here is we touch upon the 200 moving average, this green line on Friday morning. And we have now also reached to oversold RSI and reached to negative MACD. If we expand that further onto the daily chart, what we have here is we saw a divergence back on Thursday, same action on Friday. We're no longer at overbought on the RSI. And we have broken through the nine and 18 day moving averages the blue and purple lines. If we expand that further onto the weekly chart, what we have here is the current week is engulfed prior to last week's candlestick, which is a good sign that the uptrend has now stalled. And for the daily chart, if we zoom back in, what we have here for the trade idea of the week, my position size will be less than 1% of my portfolio and my entry on my long will be $338.90. That is fairly close to where we encountered previous resistance around that data back to August 17th. And since we're above that previous resistance, resistance that now act as our support. So as for my saw target on my long will be $349.45 and my stop loss will be $334.91. On the other hand, if I were to open a short position, my entry would be $351.88. That is that range right here. And for my sell target, that would be $342.96 and my stop loss for my short will be $354.36. So how did I develop these trade ideas? These ideas come from the day-by-day -day probability model, which is available in the link below, so do check it out. As we progress to the fifth, fifth day or week of trading, we have a 56% chance for it to climb between 0 to 2%. And on the extreme case to the upside, we have a 6% chance for it to climb between 2% to 3.8%. And to the downside, we have a 31% chance for it to fall between 0 to negative 2%. And for the extreme case, to the downside, a 6% chance for it to fall between negative 2% to negative 3.8%. So if you enjoyed this content, feel free to like, comment, subscribe, and thank you for watching.